Hi everyone, welcome to the IBO Toolbox training webinar. I'm Chris Karafotis, I'm going to be your host for the webinar. For those of you that are new to IBO, I want to welcome you to our community. Whether you're just getting started with the IBO Toolbox or you're a veteran member, training is critical to your success. Over the next 30 to 45 minutes, I'm going to be putting out information on how to utilize all these amazing tools and resources that you have at your fingertips. And I know this platform might seem a little overwhelming at first, but I promise you that if you just continue to attend these webinars and take in a little bit of this at a time, you're going to be up to speed before you know it. Before we get started with the webinar, if you guys have any questions, this is going to be a kind of a Q&A um, type webinar. So if you have any questions, go ahead and put it into the chat and I'll try and answer your questions for you. Um, if this is the first time that you're attending an IBO Toolbox training webinar, what I'm going to go over is an introduction to IBO Toolbox. I'm going to go over the basics. I'm going to show you how to get started. I'm going to show you how to get helper assistance with IBO. And at the end of the webinar, I'm going to wrap it up and issue you a credit coupon code worth 200 IBO credits that you can use to redeem for advertising on the platform. And let's face it, that's why we're all here, right? We want to get that extra exposure for our business. And I got to tell you guys, you are in the absolute right place at the right time because there is no better marketing platform than IBO Toolbox. It is the bomb of marketing platforms. So again, just take in as much of this as you can. The good news is, is that I've got this webinar set up to be recorded. Um, so I'll have this over on IBO's YouTube channel later on today for you to review. There are webinars twice weekly on Wednesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and Saturdays at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. So there's um, plenty of opportunity for everyone around the globe to at least view one live webinar. And again, they're most of them are recorded, so you can view them over on IBO's YouTube channel 24-7. Um, okay, so a um, couple of other things that I want to go over. If you have not done so, please make sure to go over to Facebook and Twitter and follow IBO Toolbox over there. You want to do that because there's always something going in it on at IBO Toolbox and you want to make sure that you don't miss anything. So make sure that you head on head on over to Twitter and Facebook and follow IBO Toolbox. Okay, for those of you that don't know me, I am an IBO Toolbox member just like you. I've been here at IBO for almost five years now. I've been in this industry for about 16 years, so I've been around for a long time. <laughs> I'm a dinosaur. No, I'm just kidding. Anyways, um, in addition to hosting these webinars, I'm also the IBO Toolbox newsletter editor, and I also do training um, videos for the site. But I'm also a business owner just like you. What I do is I um, design custom unique banner graphics. I do customization for IBO social profile pages. I do splash pages. I do all kinds of graphics, and I have a special for you IBO members, it's called the IBO Starter Pack. What it includes is a professional design banner or graphic, 500 IBO credits directly transferred to your IBO Toolbox account, free setup and activation, free hosting, whatever I design for you, I'm gonna host for you for free on my servers, and you own it. You can use the graphic wherever you want on the internet. And you can order as many of these IBO starter packs as you like. You don't, it's not just a one-time deal or if you're brand new or whatever, you can order as many as you want. In fact, I have some members that have came back to me throughout the years and have ordered dozens of these starter packs. So again, you can order as many as you want. To find out more about what I'm offering, you can visit my IBO social profile page forward slash IBO trainer. And then just click here where it says, says click here to order your IBO starter pack and that's going to pop open a pop-up um, order form and I want you to pay special attention to this business builder IBO starter pack purchase a 728 by 90 static or animated banner design receive a free duplicate 468 by 60 banner so the same exact banner in a smaller size free hosting setup and activation are included for both banners plus I'll even throw in a thousand IBO credits for this special business builder IBO starter pack so take it take advantage of that 
great offer. For those of you that don't know, the 468 by 60 runs right here on your IBO social profile page. It's really important that you have your own banner running on your own page. Your IBO social profile page is your public storefront, okay? So you want to make sure everything on this page is about you. So you don't want to give up this prime real estate to another member and have their banner running um, promoting their products or services. You want to make sure it's yours. Also, too, every advertisement at IBO has two links, one to the target website, meaning if we clicked on this banner, this would take you to my website because it's my banner. The other link is below the banner graphic. It says view advertiser. If we clicked on that, it would take us back to my IBO social profile page because, again, that's my banner. So you definitely want a banner running here. The 728 by 90 runs up top here at IBO Toolbox. This banner gets the best click-through rate here at IBO. I'm seeing anywhere between 8 and 15% click-through rate on this banner. So it's really important that you have one of these banners running. So that's why my IBO Special Business Builder Pack is a great deal. Two really important banners for the price of one. Okay, so what is IBO Toolbox? IBO Toolbox is a free study-of-the-art marketing platform. It was specifically developed to give internet marketers the ability to promote their products and services on the internet. By using this powerful suite of tools properly, you're going to see short-term and long-term results from your efforts. IBO Toolbox is a constantly growing business building platform and it protects its members in a safe haven environment for them to operate from. Now you'd think that a platform of this magnitude would have a monthly cost associated with it, but guess what? IBO Toolbox is completely free. There are no levels, packages, enrollment fees, or anything like that. IBO Toolbox is a completely free platform that's not going to tell you to upgrade after you join and all members at IBO have the same exact features and tools regardless of their financial situation. So what does IBO Toolbox do? Well, first of all, it works. You know, there's so many systems and tools out there on the internet that don't work. They're really more about the hype with no return for using them. Sorry about that, you guys. So whether you're a part-time or full-time internet marketer, you're going to quickly discover that IBO Toolbox doesn't hype it up, but rather it over-delivers on every aspect. At IBO, you're going to find the most targeted audience. IBO Toolbox averages over 300,000 visitors each day, and they're looking for opportunities just like you to make some extra money. They're finding your products and services through the search engines based on the content that you've put into IBO. Your press releases that you've published, your wall entries, your comments, they all get indexed, but it's really important to know who you're marketing to. 96% of that daily traffic is non-member traffic. You guys, this is really the best kind of traffic you can get. It's called true search organic traffic. And what I mean by that is, is that you've written pre a press release and someone's went to Google, Yahoo, or Bing, and they've entered in search terms that equal what you've written about in the press release. And that's how they're finding you. So as you can tell, you don't have to be an SEO wizard or anything like that. And let's face it, all of that is really hard um, to learn and it's constantly changing. So what I like to do is let IBO Toolbox do the heavy lifting for me um, and let them, um, Let's see, hang on just one second, I'm going to get this out of the way. There we go. And let them do all the heavy lifting because you know what? You don't have to know any of that stuff. You just write your press release, you give it a few keywords, and then IBO Toolbox works its magic and it gets it indexed out there on the search engines. And many, many members have gotten their press releases indexed up there on the first page of Google within a very short amount of time. So again, you don't have to be an SEO expert or anything like that. You just really just need to participate in the platform. Okay, sorry, kind of got off on a tangent there, but I I just want to let you know how simple it is to get found here when you participate in the platform. IBO Toolbox is a community of like-minded internet marketers just like yourself and it was specific, specifically developed for the internet marketer. Every feature tool widget and app was developed 
to help you market your business. And the cool thing about IBO is that it allows you to build a business relationship with the other members first, getting them to know, like, and trust you. So, you know what, there's no need for that pushy, buy this or join me here type of environment that really no one likes being around. When you offer value first, such as offering IBO Toolbox and offering value to your associates and your visitors that find you, um, that's always going to open the door to opportunity and then business will flow naturally. So here's what I'd like for you to do. I'd like for you to think of IBO Toolbox as your back office because it really is your back office. Similar to the back office that you have with your network marketing company or your affiliate site because that's exactly how it works. It's where you're going to do all your activity. It's where you're going to post on the wall. You're going to comment on other members' wall posts. You're going to like the posts that you see. You're going to share those posts with your other social networks. One of the great things about IBO is, is that we have a thing called the IBO Spirit. And we can't possibly join everyone's business, but what we can do is we can help by sharing other members' businesses to our other social networks so that they get more traffic and they get more um, prospects in front of what they have to offer. Um, so it's a very, very cool thing. Um, so what I want to do real quick before we go any further is check my questions here so I can make sure that I get all of your questions answered. Okay, so, okay, hopefully you've got sound now. I think you posted that from before. Hey, Benny, great to see you here. Um, I have a question about IBO URL um, when you have a chance. Okay. Um, you're going to have to put that into, let's see, I think it was Stephanie maybe. You're going to have to put that into um, the question bar here or the chat window here. So go ahead and ask me your question and I will get to that. I'll come back to that. Okay, how often would the 728... Um, banner run on IBO's front page, on IBO toolbox you mean. Okay, so this this 728 by 90 banner rotates with the other members running their banner. So it really depends on how many people or how many members are running their banner in this location. Okay, so it, it's really based on a few things. How many members are running their banner in this location and obviously um, how many places you set up or if you display it to run here, okay? So if there's a lot of members running their banner, obviously your banner is going to run in rotation with those members running their banner here, okay? I hope that makes sense. So it really just depends on how many people are running a banner or members are running a banner in this location because your banner is going to rotate with those other members that are running their banner in this location. Okay, um, let's see, what's the next one here? Is a contributor button important and do you only get it from buying credits? A contributor button is, or a badge, is very important. It shows others that you're serious about your business enough to put a little bit of money behind it, um, that you're, you're serious enough about your business to promote your business. Um, it also sets you apart from the other members here on the platform. It shows you as a leader. What do I mean by that? Well, as this platform continues to grow, you're always going to be looking for ways to make yourself stand out in a crowd. And having a contributor badge is going to be one of those ways or is currently one of those ways. So if you're a contributor, um, first of all, you're going to get this contributor badge, okay? And also, too, um, you can get the contributor badge by being part of Club IBO. Okay, so you either purchase credits or become part of Club IBO. Okay, so you also get this green ribbon around your wall entries, okay, or wall post entries. You're identified as an IBO contributor. I can't highlight this, but an IBO contributor 
wall post. Okay, your your wall. And let me back up. Your wall posts are identify you as an IBO contributor. So as you can see, you're getting a little bit more attention because your wall posts are, you know, decorated with this green ribbon. So um, the other reasons why it's important to or what will make you stand out if you visit the credit center um, here at IBO. Here, let's see. If we click on credit center here and we go down to um, contributor badge, okay? So shows others that you're serious about your business, makes you stand out. Nothing shows more IBO spirit than displaying your contributor contributor badge um, shows everyone how much you love this platform by supporting it. Let's talk about that for a second. This platform is free for us to um, be members here and promote our businesses and services, but a platform like this is not free to run. In fact, this platform costs thousands of dollars every single month. This platform stays running 24-7 for us. So one of the ways that we can give back to a platform that does so much for us marketers is by purchasing credits or becoming part of Club IBO. Um, leadership, junior members and newbies to this industry join IBO looking for help. So by displaying your badge, you are identifying your profile and post as being a leader in the industry. And then the last thing that you get with be becoming a contributor or a badge holder is you, current badge holders earn double credits for press releases, publishing press releases, commenting on um, press releases and videos, limit one per video and press release, um, and referring other members to IBO, okay? So you'll earn double credits for that and for logging in daily. So you get double credits for those activities. Um, if you are part of Club IBO, you get double credits on any of your purchases, on your credit purchases. So there's lots and lots of benefits. A lot of members are IBO club members and also um, IBO, um, they purchase credits as well. Okay, just makes a lot of sense. You get a lot of benefits for being both. Okay, um, hopefully that makes sense for you. If not, um, just put your question in the box here. What are the purposes of having so many links? I understand. Oh, okay. So here's your question about the IBO URL. What are the purposes of having an IBO link? Okay, I understand the tracking and hiding your link. Are there ways I can monetize these like many of the link shortener websites? Okay. Um, first of all, an IBO URL, let me show you one here. Um, let me just put in one that I have. Um, IBO URL, whoops, da, 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 dot net. Okay, I've got one for rebrandable traffic. Okay, so the thing about the IBO URL is, is that if you create a dot net alias, Okay, and I'll, and I'll show you how to do this here in a second, but I just want to give you an idea of what it looks like. If you create a .NET alias, you're going to brand it in a more, um, more in a manner that's, that's going to make sense. You know, like some of those other link shorteners like Bitly or your Google, Google link shorteners, those, those ones, um, track me, those other ones, they just put like a number after it and some characters and that really doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But what I like about the IBO URL is that you can further brand it and give it a name. So like for this one I'm promoting rebrandable traffic. So I went and created an IBO URL .net alias and I named it or gave it the alias of rebrandable traffic. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. So in the, uh, in the browser um, bar here, it's, it gives that URL. So that makes a whole lot of sense. Now, the other thing is, is that you can, um, give it a name here in the, um, 
in the tab. So this one I just named rebrandable traffic. The other thing is, is that these IBO URLs, if you choose to display the menu bar, which is this bar up top here. What it does is it pushes the whole web page down a little bit. And so here you're branding yourself. You've got your name here, you've got your likes, you've got your comments, you've got your quick access to your videos. So if somebody were to click on that, let me just move this out of the way here. Um, click on that, there would be quick access to each one of your videos over here. Okay, the last, 10 I think it displays. Um, yeah, the last 10. Um, the same thing with your press releases, displays the, the last 10 recent press releases. And then the other thing too, and you anybody can click on these and it would take you to um, that press release. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Um, let's see. The next thing is there's a learn more or the live chat button, okay? So if somebody were to visit this page and they had some questions about it, they might click on this learn more. So what happens is this drop down menu appears and then they can enter in their name um, and their email address, their phone if they want, and they can put their question right there and then they can click on send request. So what happens with that is now it becomes a lead for you and all the leads are visible over here at IBO Toolbox under the My Leads section under site navigation here. So yes, that means that you can use this platform to generate or build your list, generate leads. Leads are generated through the IBO URL that I just showed you, through your IBO social profile pages, and also through referring new members to IBO Toolbox. You get all of their information. Okay, so that is really cool. And then live chat, if somebody were to click on this, it's going to go over to and it's not going to work because I'm doing this webinar. Um, yes, it is. I lied. <laughs> I do this every time because I keep forgetting. I don't always try and chat with myself live. <laughs> okay, so um, it says, welcome to IBO chat. This chat system will put you in direct contact with, contact with the site owner slash operator. Complete the information below and then click on request chat. So somebody could put their name in here and their phone number or email if they want, um, but they only have to put their name in and then they click on the, this request chat. So what happens is this chat actually comes up down here at the bottom of IBO toolbox. And instead of saying, um, you know, like if Athena and I were going to chat with each other, it would say, up here requesting chat from IBO Social. And then it would say guest one, two, three, four, or something like that. So then I could chat with this person and they might ask me about my, um, my compensation plan or they might ask me about, um, you know, something about rebrandable traffic because that's where um, they, you know, they, they got my information from was from my IBO URL. So I could send them a file, maybe I wanted to show them the traffic that I'm getting. Um, I could share a whiteboard, um, I could, you know, view the chat his history, clear the conversation, or play a game with them if I wanted to. So it's very, very cool. I could send them a link and I could say, okay, here I just put up a web page. This is all the traffic that I'm getting. This is how, um, or a PDF file, this is how I, um, how the traffic is broken down. So it's very cool. Um, so, you know, you could do all kinds of things with this chat. This is a great, great feature to have. Okay, so that's the IBO URL. Um, so, um, and then also too, it's got your ratings, your stars and ratings up here. And then there's also links to your other um, social networks that they could go and check you out over there. So that's why I like to use this. So let's go over real quick and let's just go over this. Um, so to create an IBO URL, you're going to go to the site navigation, you're going to click on IBO URL, or you can go to IBO apps. We're just going to go directly to IBO URL. Okay, so here are all my IBO URLs, and this is what it looks like when you create one that's, um, 
you know, just from scratch here. Okay, and then you can give it a um, a .NET alias. So to create one, you're just going to slip, click on Create IB, New IBO URL. You're going to give it a friendly name. This is for your reference only, and this is going to be located over here. So I am just going to do, um, let's see here, I'm trying to think. Okay. Um, all right, so IBO custom banner deal, okay. Um, so I'm going to give it a link, and I don't know what that is. Let's see here. I think it's this one. Okay, um, and then I'm going to give it a page title. So the page title is going to be visible up here on the page tab. So um, uh, let's see, custom um, banner for IBO custom order deal. Okay, so for those of you that don't know, I can set up a custom order um, that might in, include IBO credits or IBO exchange coins or um, IBO list. Um, months of Club IBO, and I can even throw in a custom banner design. So I've got a form that I need people to go and fill out when um, they want a custom banner designed in the custom IBO order deal. So then um, I'm going to give it some keywords. So I'm going to just put in custom banner design, um, IBO banner um, deal, I don't know, um, advertising, uh, something like that, okay? And then I'm going to go ahead and show the top menu bar, and I'm not going to auto show anything. That would mean like I would display on the right hand side like the um, learn more, um, create a free IBO toolbox account, or display my press releases or my videos. So we're going to set up the first one um, without any um, anything in there. Okay, so we're going to click on Save, and then we're going to go and find that, and it's listed alphabetically. So um, it's this one right here, okay, because we just created it. So if I were to just click on this one, see, it just gave me an ibourl.com forward slash 2URK. Well, that really doesn't brand that link or anything like that. So I could go here and add an alias, but let's go over and see what this looks like. So I'm going to click on this. Okay, so um, actually this is for website visitors, okay. <laughs> All right, so um, I've got this link up here so it doesn't mask at all, and then up here it says custom banner for IBO custom order deal. Okay, so it's totally not right with the page that it's displaying, but that's okay, you get the idea. So I've got my menu bar up here. So if I wanted to go back to this and I wanted to edit it, um, I might um, just put in, I could change it if I wanted to, but this is just, you know, I could change the, the thing here. I could change this to um, traffic order form or something like that, but we won't worry about that. But I might want to do a learn more here or a create an IBO account. That would be better. Okay, I'm going to save that. I'm going to add a .NET alias. So since this is not really what it is, it's um, traffic order form. So I'm going to name it traffic. Uh, I'm going to put order website traffic. How about that? I think I already did this one. Okay, so let's see what happens. Yep, okay. Um, I'm just going to put order your website traffic. Okay, that should be taken, not taken. Okay, so now I have the .NET alias, so I'm going to click on that. And as you can see, I've got the .NET alias showing up there, so that makes a lot of more sense than the 2URK, right? Order your website traffic, okay? Um, got my order form, and over here I've got 
this um, drop down that says want your own free IBO toolbox account and so somebody that goes to this order form could say hey yeah that would be great okay so I'm gonna start I'm gonna go ahead and enroll um, create a free account okay so then again that becomes a lead for you that goes over to your lead section at IBO. So that's an IBO URL and a .NET alias. That's how you create it. So at any time, you can edit it. You can reset the count. So I've got one here. So I want to reset that. So that changes it back to zero. Okay. Um, so you can create as many of these as you want. I'm going to go ahead and delete this. So I'm going to remove it clicking the red X says okay and now it's gone okay because I already have one for that one all right so that's the IBO URL hopefully that answers your question okay if you miss the webinar is there a chance that when we watch it on YouTube we can still use that credit code um, the same day yes it is um, time sensitive and you always want to make sure that you catch the live webinar if you can I know sometimes you know your schedule doesn't always um, um, you know let you do that but um, it's really good if you could catch the live webinar and then you can go back and review the things that you don't understand um, and that's usually, unless there's some sort of glitch and I can't get it recorded, then we've got a problem. Um, all right, let's see. So the first link on the left is the browser bar and the bottom right, is this in the bottom right? One is the tab, yes. Okay, um, all right, great. Okay, so I think I've answered all of your questions. So um, what I wanna do now is I just wanna kinda go over what's over here on the site navigation. Um, at any time, I want you guys to click on or you know click on these links here to see what what's behind them because there's gold behind each one of them. So let's just kind of go over everything. We've already kind of went over the dashboard. We've got our My Lead section, which I explained to you earlier. Um, this is where you find out the information about the leads that you generated generate here on the platform through the IBO URLs, through referring new members to IBO, and also through your IBO social profile pages. You've got your My Messages area. This is where you send and receive and reply to messages from your associates. Um, you've got your My Associates. This gives you a listing of all the associates that you have here at IBO. There's also a cool search feature where you can search for um, members on the platform. You don't have to be associated with them. You can use different search queries such as join date, geographic location, um, company name, um, name of the member, their phone number, or their Skype ID. Um, you can find members that way. And I always want to caution you, okay? The members here on the platform are not your prospects, okay? They're the ones that you want to build those relationships with. So those of you that are thinking, oh, these are leads, you need to build those relationships with them first, okay? Don't just pounce in with a phone call, you know, thinking that they're a lead or a prospect for you for your business, okay? Members aren't prospects or leads. They're ones that you need to build that relationship. We are in the business of relationship marketing. So it's all about building those relationships, getting people to know, like, and trust you. Then business will flow naturally. Okay. Um, my advertising. This is where you're going to create your listing ads and set up your banner advertising. Credit Center. You can learn everything there is to know about credits here at the Credit Center. How you can earn free credits, how you can purchase credits, your credit history. Um, Club IBO. Um, free credits, how you can get free credits here on the platform, such as attending the webinars, reading the newsletter, and um, the daily credit codes um, are ways that you can get free credits. Um, we're going to come back to edit our, your profile because I want to make sure that you get that profile set up properly. 
Um, edit account is where you can change your password. You can also um, change the way or the notifications that you receive from IBO Toolbox on behalf of the other members that, or your associates that publish press releases or comment on your press releases or videos. Um, IBO apps, this is where you create your IBO URLs, it's where you create your press releases, where you edit your press releases, um, your Facebook application, you can set up a free um, response magic autoresponder and tie that to your lead section here. Um, you have to create it through um, IBO toolbox to make it work properly with your um, lead section, uh, with the leads that you generate here on the platform. Um, press releases, okay. Um, one thing that I wanted to show you real quick with press releases is you can edit press releases here or create them. Create is pretty simple, you just follow the um, Follow the prompts here, give your press release a title, the website link, which is the target website, wherever you want your visitors to go um, when they read your press release, your keywords, and then your, your content editor here. Um, I'm not going to go into a lot of detail about this content editor. I did that last week. I've got a video over at um, Market with Chris, which is one of the ways that you can get help here on the platform. Um, that will walk you through everything about adding an image to your press release, um, video, how to paste in content to your press release, all of that um, if you need help with it. Um, also too, this is where you edit your press releases, so if you want to edit something, a press release, you would come here, click on the notepad document, and then you can simply edit the press release. Okay, you can uh, let's see. You can um, change things around. You can add in an image. You can make the image clickable. Um, you can change the color of the text. Um, all kinds of things. Okay, so that's the press release. And again, this is where you come to edit, or at any time you can delete press releases if you want. Edit is the notepad. Red X is the delete. And all of these press releases are pushed out to HomeBiz blogs. They're pushed out to your profile on your behalf from IBO Toolbox, alerting the other members that you just published a press release with a link to comment on it, to view the press release and comment on it. Um, and also, to it's pushed out to Facebook and Twitter. It's pushed out to IBO's Facebook page. Um, and also... Um, I'm sorry, not Facebook page, um, uh, network blogs, um, which is pushing it out to Facebook, and it's pushed out to IBO Social's Twitter page. Okay, that's where the links to your press releases are pushed out. Somebody asked me at the help desk the other day, I'm not seeing it posted on my Facebook or Twitter page. It doesn't automatically post there, but you definitely could share it on those pages and just simply by clicking on the share button on your, um, either on the link, on the wall, or on your IBO social profile page. Okay, um, let's see. We've got IBO resources, we've got the newsletter, referral links, that's where you pick up your links and um, graphics to promote IBO toolbox. Um, search, I already mentioned that earlier, IBO Help Desk, that's where you can get help. If we go there, um, you've got FAQs, you've got a knowledge base, FAQs, you've got the videos, help videos, and you also have, um, you can search for something and get instant results, or you can create a ticket here. Um, the other way that you can get help or assistance at IBO, you've got this help tab. You can fill out a ticket, you can go straight to the help articles, you can attach a file or take a screenshot um, here, uh, let's see, um, on, let's see here, on the bottom right of every internal page there's a section assistance area, so that's the other way that you can get help or assistance. Let me just show you what that looks like here, it's right here. 
Okay, so we're on the dashboard. So, for instance, if you wanted to know how to comment on a wall post, you just simply click on that link. It's going to pop open a video. You can watch that, and it'll walk you through how to comment on a wall post. Um, again, we've got um, my site, Market with Chris, which is where all the IBO Toolbox training is. Um, you just click here to go over there to join or register for free. And this gives you all IBO Toolbox lessons okay they're all 100% free you don't have to pay for the IBO toolbox lessons I do have other lessons over here on LinkedIn Pinterest um, Facebook ads and other courses that you can take for a very um, small price I mean very very minimal price um, but the IBO toolbox lessons are 100% free for you to take and also to every lesson that you complete for IBO Toolbox you earn IBO Toolbox credits that can be used to redeem for advertising on the platform okay so you can earn up to 2,000 IBO credits for watching the IBO Toolbox video lessons okay so that's a pretty sweet deal alright so you just click here register for free and then just view the IBO Toolbox courses in the members area of market with Chris okay um, let's see I think that's it I think we've covered just about everything there is to cover yep all right so we're gonna go over and edit your profile if you're brand new to IBO toolbox this is the very first thing that you want to complete okay so three basic steps to get your profile completed to set up that that public storefront but believe me you're not going to want to stop after step three you're going to want to complete steps four through nine okay so step one is basic information you need your name your country geographic location if you want to be contacted by your phone or Skype ID definitely put those into the boxes here your email is always kept private IBO toolbox needed that to send you a link to confirm your uh, or activate your IBO toolbox account um, below that is is links or boxes for your IBO tube channel and your IBO gig store so you're going to click here to sign up for free or register for free your IBO toolbox logins will not work you can certainly choose your IBO toolbox username provided it hasn't already been taken for these two platforms um, once you get done you're going to come back over and you're going to put in your channel URL for IBO tube and your gig store URL your channel um, URL for IBO tube is going to look similar to this but of course it's going to have your username in place where I've got my username okay um, and then click on save step two is your profile image you're going to upload a real picture of you not use a logo or a product image it's really important think of IBO toolbox as your online meeting room where we're meeting in person okay so you want to use a real picture of you click on change profile image select a picture from your computer and upload it step three is business information um, you're going to enter in your information about each one of your businesses these are going to show up on your profile um, so you want to enter in your business name your title business links to your business opportunity or product website and um, as you can see I have uh, two different links here I'm not really promoting a business opportunity so what I did for BizOp banners was I created an IBO URL .net alias and I named it IBO starter pack so that's another way that you can brand yourself um, by doing that with your business URLs and then click uh, or do a short business description or write up and click on save at any time you can edit or delete now if you want to stop after step three that's perfectly fine just make sure that you return to the dashboard that's the way that IBO toolbox knows that you completed your profile and then they will automatically transfer over those 500 advertising credits um, if you close out the tab or log out you won't get your credits until you log back in if you've referred somebody to IBO and you see they've completed their profile but you haven't gotten your credits it's because they haven't returned to the dashboard so it's your responsibility to get with them and have them complete their profile okay um, let's really just real quick go through steps four through nine step four is adding the contributor you can click here to add the contributor badge 
Um, step five is customizing your IBO social front page. Two editors, there's a design editor, you can add video, graphics, um, text, um, do all kinds of things, or the HTML editor. Okay, um, click save when you get done. Step five is business links or backlinks. These show up on your profile and get picked up on the search, by the search engines. Um, you just need to put in your link name and your link URL and click save at any time you can edit or delete. Step seven is your social networks. You're going to choose from the drop down menu and you're going to enter in the relevant URL in the box to the right. Um, for Facebook, you want to make sure that the first Facebook entry here is your fan or a like page so that you get a nice little widget on your IBO social profile page um, that displays your or shows off your fans or likes. Um, step eight is your business videos. This is where you're going to upload videos to your profile. Um, so you're going to give your video a title, you're going to put in your YouTube URL, the more info or target website link, and give it a few video keywords and click on save. Then step nine is the opportunity to monetize your profile with Google AdSense. So you're going to create a free Google AdSense account with Google. You're going to look for an ad size 160 by 600 and you're going to find within your Google AdSense account, you're going to find a script that looks similar to this, which is the ad code. You're going to copy that and paste it in here to the box. You're going to comply with the terms and conditions here by checking the boxes and click on save. Now we're going to go over to the profile to see how everything comes together. Again, if it's the first time that you're completing your profile, you want to return to the dashboard. To get to your IBO social profile page, you can click on the link below where it says my IBO social profile. So we'll click on that and we've got our picture. We've got our name, our geographic location, our stars, our likes, our comments, our badges. Um, the date that we joined IBO, or in my case, the date that I set up the IBO trainer account. My phone and Skype ID would go here if I wanted that visible. If I filled in my IBO tube channel URL, I would have this nice little widget here on my profile. Um, the IBO toolbox associator widget is automatically displayed here on your profile. Your social media sharing section. Um, is here in this area. Business links are in, right here. Your visitor information, your Facebook feed. This is the one that I said the first entry needs to be a fan or a like page. You have your RSS feeds for your press releases and your wall post feeds. Um, your associates listing here. Your Google AdSense running over here. Um, we're going to scroll down to the bottom, links to your other social networks. You've got your Facebook comments in this area. You've got your community or business owner wall comments here. And you've got your IBO customization area in this area here. You've got your um, banner advertising. And again, hopefully it's your banner running on your page. And you've got a menu bar. Home is where we're at now. Businesses gives you a nice professional listing of the businesses, kind of like a business card listing. This is step three on edit your profile. Um, press releases, quick access to all the press releases that you have. Videos, same thing, quick access to your videos. Learn more, this is where you generate leads. Anybody that fills in their information here becomes a lead for you at IBO. Under the My Leads section, search, you have your own branded search engine. And uh, you can give that out, the link out, or anyone could come, your visitors could come and put in something in the box here and search and get instant results. Um, and then we've got a link to the main IBO hub. Oh, another question that I got asked um, this week at the help desk, how to view the mobile version of your IBO social profile page. Well, if we click on this, um, obviously I'm not using a mobile version to do, um, or a mobile device to do this webinar. So if we click on this, what happens is it brings up your mobile version. Okay, so as you can see, the address is different. It's got an M dot 
ibosocial.com forward slash IBO trainer. So this is kind of how it looks like on your mobile device. Okay, so that's how you view the mobile version. Um, so these are links up here. All right, so before we go over to see the main hub, hopefully you're understanding that 96% of this traffic that IBO receives is non-member traffic. That's why it's so very important to participate here in the platform, to have your profile set up and running, completely set up, all nine steps going here. You don't want to miss anything, right? This is your page. It's your public storefront, so make sure you've got that going. Constantly participate in the, in the platform. Have your banner ads running, your listing ads running, and just really, really, really be super duper active. That's how you get in front of all that traffic because it all comes here to IBO, so you definitely want to get noticed, right? And you can do that. Um, by participating, running banner ads, listing ads, and so forth, and commenting, um, and writing your press releases, and just getting all in here at IBO. All right, so if we go to the main ibosocial.com, we've got our uh, featured member of the day. We've got all of his information, a link to his profile. We've got a banner ad going up here. Um, We've got uh, the 10 most recent press releases that are displayed here on the main IBO social hub, a link to the target website, a link to the members IBO social profile page. We have our new members over here. If you were to click on their picture, it would take you to their IBO social profile page. We've got our member listing ads, link to the target website, link to the member's IBO social profile page. We've got our 10 most recent videos, link to the target website, link to the member's IBO social profile page. And then we've got the recent social activity. So I'm going to refresh this. We're going to go back to the dashboard. Okay, so kind of just take a look at this, and then we're going to go like a mental picture here, and as you can see, the same is over here. So that's what I mean by constantly participating, because remember, this is where the outside traffic is going to see you. So even though the members are just seeing this in here, it's also being seen on the outside. So again, that's why it's really important to participate, get your banner ads running, your listing ads running, your press releases going, your videos going, really, really, really important because people, anybody can click on any one of these links, a visitor, anyone, okay, go to the member's IBO social profile page, they can click on their press release and go and read all about them, um, you know, so. Very, very important. So hopefully you're understanding how powerful this platform is and what it can do to help you take your business to the next level. So let's wrap it up. Thank you so much for using IBO Toolbox to grow your business. IBO Toolbox works as a collective. The power in the system is generated by active members putting out indexable content. And the more content the members put out, the more often and higher your information is going to be found in the search results of interested prospects. You guys, this platform is going to do more for your business than most expensive paid sites or free sites, for that matter, will ever do. Okay, IBO Toolbox is a 100% free platform relies on its members to help support them. And there's different ways that you can help support IBO Toolbox. We want to make sure that IBO Toolbox stays free for all of us. So um, you can support IBO Toolbox by purchasing credits, becoming a contributor, becoming part of Club IBO, or by visiting third-party sponsor advertising throughout the platform. So one of the ways is to visit the sponsor advertising. So this is sponsor advertising, this is sponsor advertising. So if you click on these, it helps keep IBO Toolbox free. So what I want to do is I want to show you, um, we want to go to the Credit Center, and I want to issue you your credit coupon code. So click on Credit Center, click on Redeem Coupon, and this is going to open up a pop-up box, okay? So this explains um, 
about the third party advertising and to visit these ads. In fact, you're going to have to check a box that says that you've participated and have clicked on a few ads. So before you do, I give you that. So everybody go and click on, you know, one of the links here and uh, click on one of these ads here. Okay, everyone do their part to help keep IBO Toolbox free. So the credit coupon code for tonight or for this webinar is branding, B-R-A-N-D-I-N-G. So I can definitely click that I or check that I participated and clicked on a few ads and then redeem coupon. Okay, should say accepted 200 credits were added. All right, you guys, thank you so much for coming to the webinar, taking time out of your busy schedule to learn how powerful this platform is. Um, hopefully it was worth it for you, and um, now you can really interact, engage, and participate in the platform and take your business to the next level. I'm going to have a link up for Saturday's webinar. I'm going to announce that on the wall here in just a few minutes, and I'll have this recording up later on, so you can definitely go back and review it. You guys have a great Wednesday. Go IBO.